You know, I'm so grateful, just like you are, to be able to fish with my family all the time. And you're you're definitely a fishing family. Yeah. <laughs> And my wife, Katie, she loves fishing too. And one of the best parts about taking Katie out on the Harris chain is the fact that she's been down there with me when I fished tournaments. And uh, Katie got to experience all of that. <laughs> uh, that's like a three pounder at least. Got one. Mom, you got one? Uh oh, is that a good one? Me? Yes. Hey, mommy. Sweetwater, presented by Waypoint. Eli, are you ready to go fishing? Are you frozen? Are you silly? All right, so I think that I should get to make a few decisions of where we go this morning. And I mean, we might be able to do some fun stuff today. There's so many cool things to do here at Logan Martin. There's a lot of fun things we can go do as a family. Yeah, but, but Dad, before we get out to the main link, can we go catch that bass I saw jump? You did see a bass over there. That's, true. that's a good sign. Yeah, that's a good day. sign. That might be they're busting even crazier on some other places. Pre-storm. So, so can we go try to get it? You can make one cast there on the way out, okay? Good. <laughs> I'm excited, babe. This is gonna be fun. We're gonna get to go out and catch some fish. It's always fun to be yeah. on the water with the family. Oh yeah, I work so it's much guiding fun. and fishing tournaments. It's always fun when we get to go with the family. Wait a minute, you guys don't have to do school today? Yeah. They're is off this school. a field trip day? Aren't you gonna do school this afternoon when we're done fishing? I don't think. I don't think. I think you can take the. We'll put this down for a field trip. How field trip that? day. Sounds good to me. Sweetwater field trip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. High five. Let's do this thing. Nice. Eli, high five. Ow. Daddy, up high. Hello. Oh, what? Go. <laughs> you got me again. I said, too slow. Gotta go. Gotta go. You're gotta funny. go. You know, I'm so grateful, just like you are, to be able to fish with my family all the time. And we travel a lot, but one of the coolest things that it was really Jessica's idea was to homeschool the kids. I mean, she, right away when Zeke was born, she was like, you know, I want to homeschool the kids. I was like, okay, that never really crossed my mind. But you know what? With our lifestyle and with a fishing lifestyle, to be able to travel together and, you know, spend that time together on the road, but then to also be able to, when I'm home at Logan Martin, take my kids fishing and take Jessica fishing. I mean, it's just such a cool thing. You're, you're definitely a fishing family. Yeah. And my wife, Katie, she loves fishing too. And, and I love being able to share that with her as well. You got one, dude. Got one. No way. First fish, right on the bank. Keep winding hard. Good job. Dude. One fast. He's not even fighting. One fast. It might be big if he's not fighting. He might just not even know he's hooked yet. Oh, oh yeah, swing him in, swing him in. Swing him toward dad. Oh, Ziggy. Good job. You're on the Thank board. You. Good job. <laughs> Eli and Z. I just threw it right up there, and then I picked it up and went, don't. What? Wait, just a minute, Eli. Hold first. on. First. Yeah. Look at that, on the jack. I got the first fishy on the jack. Come on. Gotta throw it in there. That is beautiful, Zeke. Yeah. Do you and Eli want to let it go? I want to. I'm going to let it go. Okay. I'm going to hold it. OK, you can hold it. Let him hold it for a sec. Eli loves touching fish. Dude, first, was that your, what, your second or third cast? Oh, uh, yeah. All right, Eli. Can you give him a fish bump? That was my third cast. Fish bump him. Fish bumpy. All right. Zeke, we're on the board. Oh, that was a, <laughs> that was a good kiss. I got to be honest, I'm, I, I'm always telling Katie, I'm a little bit jealous that you guys live on Logan Martin because it's such a great fishery to, to go out and just catch fish. I mean, yep. you can catch fish regardless of the season. It's, it always seems like there's just a plentiful amount of, of spotted bass as well as largemouth. Yeah, it's a great place to be a guide and it's a great place to take kids and your wife fishing for sure. Where were you guys staying down there in Florida? It was the Lakeside Inn in Mount Dora and that place is incredible. I'd actually fished around the dock there at the Lakeside Inn, but I'd never seen it from the shoreline. It is gorgeous. That's awesome. Sounds like a perfect place to set up and go have a blast with your wife. I am Katie Berghoff. I am married to Miles. We've been friends for about 20 years, married for almost five. Miles and I actually really love to go fishing. I used to go fishing with my dad all the time when I was a kid. So it's always been something that I love doing. And so when the weather is right, because I'm not gonna lie, I'm more of a fair weather fisherman. We love to go fishing. <laughs> I got a fish, babe. <laughs> I got a fish on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> oh, that's a nice one. <laughs> Coming at you. Spicy. <laughs>
feisty. Look at that fish. Oh, oh good it's... first fish, babe. Look at that. And On did... the mag fatties. There you go. Look at that fish. Beautiful That's beautiful, fish. right? Yeah. It's nice and white because this, this kind of dirtier water, and when they get offshore, they get, they get really light colored. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get a picture. <laughs> We're going to get a selfie together. <laughs> nice. Big fish. Bye, fish. Thank See you, bud. Fish. Right on. For more Sweetwater action, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And remember, you can watch any of our episodes on any device at any time on waypointtv.com. Sweetwater is brought to you by Waypoint TV. Stream the best in hunting and fishing series. Download the app today. Wiley X. B&W Trailer Hitches. Towing Adventure. Battleborn Batteries. Get out there, stay out there. Power Pole. Swift, silent, secure. And by Scales. Every degree of water. That grass edge that Katie and I started on really did have quite a few fish on it. And then Katie hooked into one and it was it was pulling pretty hard. <laughs> and she got she fought it perfectly. She got it right up to the boat and it really jumped. <laughs> Keep it tight. Keep it tight. Fight around the troll motor. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's get the net. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Where was my net? <laughs> hey, quick release. That's right. <laughs> Bad shoulder. Oh. That was good. That was good, babe. Right. Yeah. <laughs> good job. You know. Yeah, that's just part of the game, and it's a part of the game I don't like. <laughs> but it's one of those things where it's like, you, you know, to win a tournament, you have to be on enough fish to lose some fish and still win. And, you know, going out fun fishing, too, it's not as heartbreaking, but it still hurts anytime you have a fish right up to the boat and it jumps off. But, you know, part of the experience is getting that bite, setting the hook, getting that fish to the boat, and, you know, losing fish is just part of the game. One of the best parts about taking Katie out on the Harris chain is the fact that she's been down there with me when I fished tournaments and uh, Katie got to experience all of that and she got to watch all the live coverage and all that, but she never got to really get on the water and experience what it all looked like on the water. So it was really cool being able to, to show her all the things that I get to experience every single time I come down to fish a tournament on the Harris chain that she doesn't get to see on the sidelines. I totally know what you're talking about. I mean, when I'm out on a tournament, if I'm not on live or, you know, updating my bass track, I mean, they don't know, Jessica doesn't know how well I'm doing or what's going on. And so it really does make sense that it was super cool for you to show her the body of water that you spent so much time on. It kind of puts a picture, an image, and she can see. It's like, okay, so this is what he was out there doing all day. And so I know the suspense has got to be just absolutely brutal for a fisherman's wife to be at home, left at home while we're out there trying to catch them and, you know, waiting to see the end results at weigh-in, but it really lets them see the full picture when they get to go out there on the water with you. Oh. Oh! Oh, nice hook set. Keep, keep that line tight. Keep that line tight. Oh, that's a nice fish. Good get the fish. net, get the net. Good fish. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah! Good fish! Nice! Whoa! Jumped good it. hook set and all! Gosh, I'm such a good teacher. Oh, I thought you could do uh, yeah, Look at you. that. Like, he wasn't coming off. He yeah, he's just choked that finesse worm. So, oh, he so did. Yeah, let me get the pliers. That was a great hook set and everything. You kept the pressure on him. Perfect. Look at that, that's a nice that's fish. That's a big fish. Baby. That is a big fish. <laughs> Go ahead and hold it up. Oh. Oh, that's like a three pounder at least. <laughs> Yard. Nice, good job, honey. Thanks, babe. Saw that finesse worm you taught me. All right, dude, I work it. Is that a bite? Set the hook, yeah, set the hook. Set the hook hard, jerk it hard. You got him, dude. Oh yeah, did you see him chase it and eat it? All right, what is it? Is that a largemouth? Swing him, swing him. Good job, Eli. Eli, largemouth. Look at that guy. Can you let him go right here, nice and gentle? So we can go back to his mommy. Okay, that was pretty gentle. 
Good effort, man. Good job. Get on the rod. Eli, you caught a fish. So our lifestyle is pretty interesting because it's not your traditional lifestyle, I guess. Um, being married to a professional fisherman, he's on the water all the time. That's pretty much his office. And then the kids are homeschooled so that we travel together as a family. We kind of like to stick together and just do it all together. So it's a lot of fun. We go out fishing as often as possible as a family. Um, he does have to work a lot, so you know it's not every day, but um, every vacation we go on also is totally based around fishing, so we get a lot of uh, vacation time with fishing when we travel to see his family and things like that. But I would say every opportunity Joey has to take uh, the kids out or take us all out as a family, we're, we're on the water. Got one. Mom's got one. Uh-oh, is that a good one? Nice. Mom. Mommy's on the board. Me yes. and Mommy. Team effort. Team effort. I'll share it with you. How about that? Look at how good Mommy hooked him. Okay, can you kneel down right there and let him go gentle or lay down? Let him go gentle right here. All right, Eli, let him go. I'll hold your strap. Oh, yeah, Good man. job. Good job, E. You ready for this? I was born ready. All right, man. <laughs> man, that new Chrome B&W is looking fine. Oh, you're not kidding, man. That's a beautiful hitch. <laughs> of all the things that we've added to our trucks over the last several years, I'd say the B&W trail hitch is the most clutch. I mean, yeah. that thing is, is super durable. It's made in America and ultra adjustable, which is my favorite feature. I mean, the fact that you can adjust the different ball sizes on it really easy and adjust the height is absolutely key. Yeah, I totally agree. The fact that they're made in America, they're ultra durable. I mean, you can just look at that hitch and you know it's going to get you to the water safely. And if you don't make it to the water, you can't go out there and have a blast and catch fish. So it really is just an amazing hitch all around. It's pretty, pretty awesome. And another thing, I know this is a big thing for you because I've seen you hit your shin <laughs> on old trailer hitches before. Yep. The fact that you can swing that out of the way so it's seamless when you're not using the hitch is pretty awesome. So, I got the dents on my shin to prove it. <laughs> so overall, great hitch. Uh, check them out at bwtrailerhitches.com. One thing I've learned, you know, fishing around Zeke and I, Eli when we, we get to go out is the fact that you've really got to kind of pace the, the day. You know, we'd been fishing for a couple hours and I could tell Eli was getting a little burnt out on it. You know, Zeke wanted to keep fishing hard, but Eli loves to bluegill fish. So I had the idea to go get him some worms and we took a little boat ride and we went back to the ramp. There's something about seeing a bobber go under. I know you know what it's all about. Absolutely. That 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 visual, you know, bite when that bobber goes down is such a, a it hooks the kids into <laughs> fishing, does. man. It, it really is a big deal. Normally in a tournament setting, like we're as like the support system, family, friends, all of that, we're all at home kind of just watching behind the scenes as Miles goes out on his tournaments every time. And there's a lot of times where if he doesn't have like a marshal or he's not updating, we don't really know what's going on. And that's kind of, it builds up your anxiety throughout the day before the weigh-in, you know, which 
is good and bad at the same time. But being able to go out there with him today, it's kind of really cool to like go out there and be part of it, you know, for the whole day and get to like experience, you know, the places that he stopped at and he has little stories and he has memories that he goes through and but we're making new memories at the same time. Keep it tight. Keep yeah, it tight. Come on. Bring it over get the, the side. Net. Bring it over the other side. Nice. Oh. <laughs> I think I can Yeah, I think one. you can both. Yeah, flip I that think one. I can do that one. Nice. <laughs> Good job. You're getting to feel that worm bite. Yeah. That was not coming Whoop. off. Here, take your little feisty fish. Hi, feisty, meisty. You get a kiss. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so much fun, though. That is a lot of fun. Thank you, fish. You know, since we caught a couple of fish here, you know, one of the things that I like to do is put the power poles down. Ooh. Those will stick in the ground and we'll just make the same exact cast. And I mean, it, it sounds counterintuitive to make the same exact cast over and over again. But yeah. a lot of times, you know, those fish are kind of weaving in and out or, you know, you didn't get it the right angle or whatever it is. So sometimes it really takes multiple casts in the same exact spot. So my guess is right when I start getting stuck in the grass again, I'm gonna get a bite like right there. <laughs> right there. Oh, now I have to be the net person. How's that for calling your shot? I was ready. <laughs> <laughs> it's about as big as the one you caught. Not even close. Oh, buddy. really? Not even close. Oh. Sweetwater is brought to you by Z-Man, the science and art of fishing. Baba, the ultimate lifestyle. Mercury Marine, go boldly. Motor Guide, the tour is back. And by Lake County, Florida. Real Florida, real close. Look, Zeke's got him. Oh, that might be a good one, Zeke. This could be a big spot. Eli, will you help me net him? Mm -hmm. Come here. Zeke, is this her? I want to net it myself. Okay, here you go. You net it. Oh, oh it's a nice oh. spot, Zeke. Oh, my. Oh, shoot, that's a grenade. That's a big grenade. Oh, that's Oh, my a... gosh. Bomb. Bring it to the net. Bring it this way? Bomb. Oh, man. Oh, we got this guy. He must be hooked good. Get him, E. Get him, E. Yay. Oh, Zeke. Yeah. Good teamwork, guys. Good water. job. Good job. Woohoo. Zeke, oh. that's a little toad right there. Oh. That's a that little is toad. A, that's a bomb. Look how fat that thing that's is. That's not a grenade. It's a bomb. That's a fat one. Oh Good my job. Gosh, Zeke, Good that's network. That's a pretty spot. Zeke, pretty fish. At that point, after catching all those bluegill and having a little snack break, I wanted to take everybody out for a little bit longer on Logan Martin, and I wanted to take them down to the dam. The cool thing about fishing a dam like the one on Logan Martin is the fact that there's so much going on. You've got a lot of current, and so all the species of fish on that lake really congregate. That feels like a bass. Maybe a good one, too. Oh, yeah. I want to wheel it. Okay, it's a nice spot, Eli. Oh, man, this is her. This is a good one. Oh, hey, don't. Man. Okay, I'm gonna get the bubba net, okay? Oh, is that a bass? Oh, yeah. Yeah, on the TRD Ooh. shot. Eli, that's a beauty. That's a tan one. <gasps> oh, what do you think of that, that one? That one's tan. What do you yeah. think of this one? Yeah, that one's tan. Here, let's tan. let him go. Can you help me? Yeah, that one's tan. He is very tan. Look at that, on a TRD on a drop shot. That is sweet. That's okay, awesome. let him go super gentle right here. Beautiful fish, Eli. Thanks for reeling him in with me. You did great. <laughs> Good job, buddy. You know, going through the Door Canal and getting into Lake Door itself, one of the coolest things that really I hadn't experienced that much before is the fact that Lake County and their artificial brush pile operation that they've been really putting a lot of effort into, it makes it really easy to find your next fishing spot. <laughs> oh 
my gosh. I think I need the net. Oh my gosh. Net boy, net boy. <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> oh man. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait a Look at that one. Oh man. That's the biggest one of the day. <laughs> you owe you me dirty dinner. girl. You owe me dinner all week now. You oh, owe me dinner. Oh no. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at the mouth on that thing. Ah, All right, almost hold your fit fish. My hand in it. <laughs> almost. Hold on. Let me grab it. Got her. Hey. Good job. Thanks. You did pretty are. awesome for your first time on the Harris chain. I know. Look at this guy. He's like half my size. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite. <laughs> oh. All right. Well, that was a great way to end the day. That was a really good way. <laughs> you get to go back on home. Good job. Bye, fish. Thank you. We had a great day. It was a full day out on the Harris chain. We caught plenty of fish. We just had a great time together. But even though we were done fishing, we were ready to go back to Lakeside Inn and, and really begin our evening together. It was great. That's awesome, man.